Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Josie here from Live at 50 and Beyond. The holidays are fast approaching and winter break is coming. And if the kids are staying at home for the holidays or during their winter break, you want to keep them busy. And in order for you to keep them busy, you got to find ways or creative ways to do so. So here are some ideas that I'm going to show you that are inexpensive, simple to make, and with materials that are readily available or easily accessible. So first off, let me show you some of the materials that we're going to use. I am dubbing holiday shakers, or you may call it ornament shakers, if you are into ornaments. But uh, things that you may use, uh, you may already have, especially if you buy things with packaging. For example, um, washies come in a packaging that's perfect for this project. We're not going to use the washi, at least not at this time, but we're just going to use the containers that it came in. I purchased these washies from the Dollar Tree, and the good thing about this washi, it already comes with built-in uh, holes, meaning a pre-punctured pre holes, so that you can put a twist tie or a ribbon if you want to hang it somewhere as uh, like i said like an ornament or if you want to give it as gifts it can be a charm and embellishments like this one after i remove the backing it already has the pre-punctured hole so another thing that i'm going to be using that fits into this exact box well a little bit of adjustment is needed to cut or trim the sides are these gift tags so this is again very easy to make and it's fun for the whole family, not only the kids, but hopefully the adults alike. So I get I got these tags also from the Dollar Tree at the gift section or gift wrapping section. And uh, for a dollar you get 18 pieces. I am also going to be using sequins and beads, mostly in the greens and blue shades so that it will kind of look more like winter blue or something like that that's the color of our theme at home but you can choose any color you like and since you will be cutting those tags to size you would need a pair of scissors getting one that's child friendly you know craft stores or even the dollar tree sells them that are very those safety scissors that are very kid friendly however if you don't want to have anything handy and you have this uh, some kind of small scissors uh, just make sure that you supervise your kids or do the cutting yourself and let them do the assembling themselves. So uh, I will be also adding some kind of seal on the edges here because there's a, there are some gaps where the folds are and the beads or sequins may fall through. So you wouldn't want to lose all the beads in the process, especially when you're shaking. And what I'm thinking, either you put some washies but I, I kind of want to keep it clear so that on all sides I can see what's inside. So I'll be using clear tapes, you know, the ones you use for gift wrapping or even some clear packaging tape if that's what you have on hand. So I will be fast forwarding from here on and I will be adding captions if uh, further explanations needed. Talk to you later.
Now watch how I would do it using another packaging. This time also packaging that I got from the Dollar Tree again. I, I don't throw away things. I I just keep them because I know that I can reuse them. So this one is perfect for a flat kind of shaker, which is probably the more popular style of shaker uh, that most crafters or card makers or paper crafters do. So I'm just trying to trim this to size again and let me show you the process. Okay, so I just want to show you some materials, other materials that you can use for your shakers. I got this one in gold and silver uh, from uh, Target Dollar Spot. And this ones I got from the Dollar Tree and they are snowflakes in blue and white. So you can use them as well on your, for your shakers. So let's enjoy for a moment the sounds that these shakers make. Because the best part is when you shake them and not only do you enjoy the look but also the sounds that they make. Here's one that I made out of a ta gift tag with a deer. And of course this one is the one with the penguin. Aren't they cute? And this one here, the snowman, I used the one from the Target Dollar Spot and the snowflakes from the, the Dollar Tree. I like the effect of the silver glitters from the target dollar spot because they look like snow and they stick to the plastic and this one of course is the flat one this is the more common type of shaker so i hope i inspired you to spend your time with your kiddos during the winter break and make these fun projects please click like subscribe and comment down below until our next project talk to you later bye bye